Hello my friends, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you guys are new here. This is Tiffany and today I am sharing with you my weekly Kroger stockpile haul. You guys know if you've been following me lately, I love to go and find all of the bargains in Kroger in the clearance finds, the meat aisle, all that kind of stuff and you have to go early in the morning to do it. Um, sometimes you find great stuff, sometimes you find nothing. So um, that's what I'm sharing with you is last week's haul. I did go a few times last week. This week I'm only going once. I'm trying to cut back on my budget so um, because there's been a lot of excessive spending with our travel sports. So you guys, I try to um, save where I can, but I love deals. I love stocking up in my pantry, in my freezer, and then pulling from that to make meals. So today's video is also part of a collaboration hosted by myself and my very dear friend, Jessica Myros. And there is a huge group playlist. All those ladies, go check out their channels, go check out their videos, go show them some love. Um, because if you're like me, you love to see what other people buy at the grocery store. So it just gives you ideas. So make sure you go check all of that out. But with much further ado, let's get going, guys. Okay, guys, here is the haul. Um, let's start over here. This was not on clearance or anything special like that. Um, I'm trying to get that focus. That's weird. It should be focusing. There we go. I got this only because I've looked and looked and looked at Aldi. I've looked and looked at, looked at Kroger Weekly for like the generic or just anything sugar-free. And even the Jell-O brand was like $1.59. This was actually on sale today. So the big box, the little boxes were like $1.59. The big box was like, a, I think, equivalent to that. So I've been dying to get this to mix into some stuff for a healthy option for dessert. And I just had to pick it up because they did not have it anywhere else. I don't know what's going on with the sugar-free stuff. They don't have it anywhere. This um, I got in the clearance aisle. Actually, they just put this in there when I went back because I couldn't get something to scan for the almonds. So I went back and then they had put some of these in there. I just got one pack for now because we have a bunch of hugs from Sam's Club. But the kids can take those with them. Traveling, always think ahead for travel and stuff. So if I would have known that Ryan loves these like he does, he was excited I bought these when I sent it to him. I had no idea. And some of them look a little, I never can remember how peanuts are supposed to look. They always look kind of nasty anyway, I think. But I didn't know Ryan likes he loves the shelled peanuts. I don't love the shelled peanuts because I hate having to deal with it. But these are 38 cents a bag. I got, I only got four bags. I put some bags back because I just didn't want to overrun it with shelled peanuts just in case some of them were going bad. Um, but I never buy these. They never have these on sale. This is softball season, baseball season. You know, I should have bought the whole cart on a slave for 38 cents. I may may go back in today and get some more of these because Ryan loves these and 38 cents is dirt cheap. Um, but I did get four bags. So I think I will go back and get those just for those. If I can just get by with getting those because they had like an overflowing shopping cart. Everybody was passing on them. Um, they had a ton of these mixed in with the peanuts and I did the math. At first I thought this was going to be more expensive by seeing the bigger price tag. It's $374. But this is the big bag of raw almonds. And we go through almonds like crazy in our house. And almonds are like $6 at the regular at Aldi's, I think, for the almonds. So that was a good deal for the big bag. I bought these the other day. Ryan was eating them. Um, so I grabbed some more of these, what I could find. $1.54. I got three of those. Um, all they had left was that kind of flavor. So people go, like, I ha there are like constant shoppers in there buying the clearance buys. If I don't pick it up, they pick it all up. Um, they load their cart full and buy it. So, um, I picked these up. This was new. They had tons of these. Um, apple cinnamon. I thought this was fun. Just a healthier snack. These were $1.76 each. So, these were the 7 ounces. Like I said, these came out 20 cents less. Wait. 20 cents less for 14 ounces. But, the big raw almonds you got 16 ounces, I think. So, you got more ounces for less. So you got more for less. But I like the way these were flavored. So I picked those up. This was random. I like almond flour. Um, I don't bake very well with it. But I got this because this had a... They had two boxes. That was it. This was one of those. It was $3.89 on the clearance. It had been like $5.89 or something stupid for this um, healthier almond... Um, brownie mix so it had a two dollar off coupon stuck to it the other one didn't so I couldn't get both of them but I picked this up for a dollar eighty nine 
This randomly, I was walking through the aisle and found this because they do like the markdowns in the aisles where it's like 70% off, 50% off. You know, they're trying to clear it out. We love carne asada, everything. I try to make my own, it never comes out right. This was a dollar something. I can't remember exactly how much. I should have actually bought more. I will buy more if I find out that this is good. Just to, I wanted to test things first. So I've got that because it goes with my favorite meat. I freaked out. I look every single week, every single time I go to Kroger, and I've been in Kroger three times this week, I'm embarrassed to say. I go every time and I specifically look for this beef taco meat. I look for it and they never have it. It's like the carne piccata. This is like my favorite meat that they carry. And like a pack of this is like 10, 11, $12. I won't pay that obviously so today they had one pack that didn't look fresh these were all fresh and I saved some I didn't buy them all but I picked up four packs of this just because I will I will make it actually probably tonight for dinner because I love it so much and I'll probably use that new sauce um, so I'm going to I bought this one um, that one that one and this one and I'm so excited you guys they still had for those people that like to get on, I think to watch my videos, just to comment that I take everything in the store, that's totally false. I don't take everything. I take what we need that we can use, that we can buy, that we can freeze, that we can store, that doesn't go to waste. And I leave stuff for other people. But, you know, honestly, there's other people that do this way more than me that go daily in there and do this. Um, I've got this. It's 307. I don't really need the beef, but honestly, summer is coming. This is the best time to stock up on it because I'm going to start shuffling through and getting the meat that's already frozen, moved up, um, that's older, and use it because we, we make burgers a lot. So, I got one of those packs. These are only 80%. Sometimes, though, I do. These are 85% lean. I think both of these are 85% lean. This one's 80%, but honestly, it depends on what you're making. Sometimes, I will use something with 80% over the leaner meat because of a preference for the flavor. So, um, but you guys know me, if you've been watching my channel long, I prefer ground turkey. It's never on sale, but next best thing is this. I love this meat. Um, I, I think these are dyes that make this so red because a lot of times this red comes off when you're cooking it, but I love Laura's lean beef. Um, they had a ton of this. I mean, they had the meat aisle stacked full of beef and pork and steak. It was everything like literally I had to move things over to look through them there was so much meat in there today so I only got two of these because I didn't want to spend an excess so I got one for 425 and one for 404 that one's 96 percent lean that one's 92 so when I make my healthier stuff yes I like my kids to eat healthy but um it all has protein it's all good but when I'm trying to watch my macros I like to use that kind of meat for stuff so I got that and then this wasn't a clearance by gavin loves sweet tea he um he's 17 now he drives he has a job he's had a job for over a year now so he likes to go to mcdonald's and use that app and get those sweet teas all the time so i picked them that up because it was 2.99 on sale i don't drink tea except for green tea occasionally so i don't know how to make it um if anybody's got any tips on how to make sweet tea let me know because i have no clue um but this haul right here what i actually came for was toilet paper and didn't end, even end up with it because to get the toilet paper deals some people told me that you didn't have to buy all five items to save five our store unfortunately you do I tried it but I didn't want to go shopping for five items um, I'm gonna wait till next week and buy the specific items on sale I'll get toilet paper then but all of this you guys was $65 so really really awesome and you'll probably see more peanuts because <laughs> I'll probably go back later Okay, you guys, I'm going to, maybe I'll show you what I have. Um, you guys know I love um, this brand called Vingley. I've partnered with Vingley before. The girls have a desk from Vingley. And then I got a stand for, if you watch my other channel, Small Town Apparel, I have a stand for like shows and things like that. I can hang stuff on. So it's really cool. Vingley has a bazillion products of furniture, of homewares, of organization, of lawn care stuff. I mean, everything. So this was a new product that they just came out with and I have a pool box. We have a pool. We have an above ground pool we put in during COVID and we have a little deck around it. So we, we like have some chairs out there. Um, but I bought Ryan a wooden pool box um, to put like drinks and things in outside and it's so cute. It was wooden. Wood's not a good idea. 
to keep out all year round because we didn't take it in. So it is like rusted out with the metal part that's inside of it. And then it has gotten like dry rotted. So I'm so disappointed because he loves that to put like little drinks in out there because it's just fun when you're entertaining. So Vingley had this product and this is perfect for our deck but it's got little wheels on the bottom. I put this together in like 10 minutes, I think. It's got this, if you have like a bottle cap, you can pop that off, drop your bottle cap in there. It's got a handle, so you can pull it. It glides, it's got wheels on it, because our other one doesn't. Um, it doesn't have any wheels. So, and then it's got this. This, um, this opens up, so you've got It'll fold over or you can take the whole thing off. It's got a really deep basin tub in there. Then it's got this drain. That way if you need to like drain it when you're done using it, it's got a hose for it to do that also. I mean, it is just, it's super simple to wipe out, you guys. Super low maintenance. But see, there's the drain plug right there. It's got a shelf on the bottom. You can put your other excess stuff on it. The whole lid comes off if you want to take the whole lid off or just put it like that. And it keeps your stuff cold. Look at that. Look how nice that is. So if you guys are in the, in the, you know, like I said, this isn't sponsored, but I just wanted to share it with you. If you guys are in the need of a cooler for your patio, for outside or, you know, whatever, um, check out Vingley and I'll link it below. And if they give me a discount code, you guys always know that I love to share discount codes. A lot of times I'll reach out to companies and ask if they can give me a discount code on things that I buy. So this is the um, cooler and I love it. Ryan's super excited to have this because we um, just looked into it. It was something new that they were featuring, but you guys check it out. Okay, my beautiful friends, that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. And if you're new here, I'd love to have you subscribe. Don't forget to give the video a big thumbs up. Check out the group playlist. And you guys, I will see you in the next one. Love you guys. Bye.